have to separate. You've got to be able to report taxes. Don't find yourself in a place where you ran through all this money and while all this money was being deposited into your business bank account, you did not use that cash flow and those deposits to your advantage. Everything you do, you need to be moving a certain way. When I talk to my students and I coach people, I explain to them about getting the gas cards and the different accounts so that they can catapult that business to the next level. The reason why businesses fail is because people struggle financially. They don't understand it. They don't understand that that money belongs to the business. Don't go out here and get X amount of credit and then be flossing with uh, a BMW roll off on your corporate account. If it's not helping you in appliance repair, why do you have it? It should be about making your business move with ease and giving you the ability to service your clients at a whole nother level. Period. It's that simple. The reason I'm telling you this is that you're going to see a lot of fake gurus out here that say they know business credit, they know this, they know that. The reality is understand your finances because they can make you or break you. Most businesses go out of business because of poor management of finances, poor management of structure, poor management of employees, and poor management of opportunities. So one thing about Ms. Ward, she's going to give it to you straight. Get your cash flow together, understand what that truly means. You should be able to take your cash flow, your invoices, you should be getting paid. Every time you ring out a customer and those invoices are deposited, every time you get a check from the warranty company, hint, hint, a check from the warranty company, you should be invoicing that out and depositing it into your corporate account because you want to account for the cash flow if you're ever called upon, uh, you know, called or audited. Some of you guys out here free nilly, y'all just think that's money in the bank. You got that W-2 mentality. If you know like I know, especially going into 2022, <laughs> the game is meant to be sold, not told. And that's all I can tell you. So with that said, I'm signing off because I'm damn sure getting ready to go get mine. Have a great day. And remember, stay focused and stay blessed. This is signing off. And that's all the steppers. Y'all know what y'all need to be doing. Keep stepping.